is Sam Altman's and the team at OpenAI, Sora AI, the coolest thing ever, or are we about to be destroyed by our own creations? All the automated AI content is already accounting for 50 million of the total videos on YouTube and the thing's barely been out for a year. This is a potential problem. We all love YouTube. It's made us laugh, it's made us cry, taught us amazing things and shown us some crazy dramas. It's been there for us through the bad times and the good times. But AI video creation is shaking things up. And OpenAI's new Sora text-to-video platform is about to change the game in ways we've never seen before. This video will answer three simple questions. How will this new software change content creation in the future? How will it change things for viewers like you and me? And the biggest question, what does this all mean for the future of YouTube as a platform? I literally predicted this months ago. A AI. AI could easily start creating all of the content on YouTube and wipe out creators. Just picture this. AI gets so good at automating and creating content that it is literally indistinguishable from the real thing. Let's see if I can do it again. But first, what actually is Sora AI? It's a text to video platform that can create videos so realistic that you'd swear they were made by humans. Check these out. Just Look at these, they are insane. Imagine the stories you could tell, the world you could build. The things you could do are only restricted by one thing, your dreams. But whilst they are amazing, they are also terrifying. Now picture this scenario. Morgan Freeman, convinced of his own wisdom, travels back in time to give his younger self career advice. And naturally, as with any other time travel movie, he completely screws up his own timeline. He ends up as a janitor, desperately trying to convince everyone that he is the Morgan Freeman with hilarious results. And that comes out as a perfect, epic, full-length movie. That's the way this technology is heading. Seriously. And who wouldn't want to watch that? I'd watch that. So what happens to video creation when we get to this point? Well, as we know, some creators already fully automate their content. That's their right to do so. But it's also my right to give my opinion on it, which is that it is soulless, boring, and a waste of my life. And right now, it's not that good, but it's about to get a whole lot better. And I can't see the improvement stopping ever. So do the creators we love then just become the most creative prompt engineers and disappear from screen leaving AI in its place? I don't think so. I have a different prediction. Suddenly those with wild amazing creative ideas can compete with Hollywood. This is the biggest game changer since the invention of the camera. Now some creators might struggle especially those making more generic type content but for the rest of us and I'd like to count myself in that category Degree, even if it is a little bit arrogant. This is an insane opportunity. YouTube won't die. If you're smart, adaptable, and passionate, this new AI is just another tool in your toolbox. Those who master it while bringing their unique voices, real stories, and building strong community connections will rise to the top. AI is the paintbrush, but creators are still the artists. And now what about the viewer? What about the way we view content in the future? Well, AI content isn't going anywhere. Anywhere, you can be sure of that. You, the viewer, are the most important part of YouTube. Without you, it'd just be a load of people talking to walls, which sometimes it feels like anyway. Which is why my next future prediction is that YouTube will give viewers new tools to navigate this changing landscape. Metadata will identify AI-generated content, and you'll get to filter what you want to see based on how much AI was involved. Maybe you only want to see human faces. Maybe you only want to hear human voices. Or maybe you don't care, and you're happy to watch anything with AI in it. I predict that the choice will be yours to make and change at any time. I know there is a divide. Kyle Hill's brilliant video on all of these random science channels popping up everywhere made it clear that a lot of you are frustrated with AI content and many of you enjoy it. And with this new tool I've predicted, the problem is solved. Get on it, YouTube. Come on. Hurry up. So what is the future of this crazy world of AI generated content? Is YouTube doomed? Whilst it seems like AI automation could destroy 
destroy YouTube. I'm more hopeful. Call me naive, but I see a future where YouTube uses this to empower creators and viewers alike. And if I'm wrong, well, in a few years, well, probably a few months at this rate, actually, you can come back to this video and laugh at me. That's YouTube, and that's why I love it. Things will change, problems will arise, but new opportunities will open up as well. As the great Sarah Connor said, the future's not set. There's no fate but what we make for ourselves. Unless you're a time traveling Morgan Freeman. Watch this video next to see my predictions on the future of computer science degrees and whether they are the next thing that AI is going to do. As I'm doing one myself, I'm all in on that topic. Peace out, guys. Thanks for watching.